into the Eastern Conference playoff picture. The Squadron and the Swarm. And we are underway on this Friday night. The first possession belongs to the Birmingham Squadron. Crutcher had it poked away from behind as the Squadron tried to run in transition. Garrett passed up an open look, and now Bailey's open from the left side and puts it in. A little strong from the corner. Long rebound belongs to the Swarm. Bailey run off the oh line, attacks, gosh. and couldn't <laughs> quite finish. But they're on the putback to clean it up. The first bucket of the night for Jeremiah Tillman. His three ball hasn't been falling as much, but he's gotten to the rim. Good twist there from Garrett. No, but Tillman's there to follow with a flush. Well, with Pokashevsky breathing right down his throat, Malcolm Hill gets another basket for the squadron. Bailey straight away this time. He's got a couple of three-point makes in this first quarter. Bazemore has a size advantage against Galen Robinson. And his fall away is pure. Watched him during the pregame work on that exact same shot. He's, he's got the Blake Gardner syndrome, folks. Exactly. <laughs> he, didn't, he hadn't found either. Inside, Mensa rolled to the rim. This team, this Greensboro team, they want to make it into an ugly game with their defense, and they're doing a really good job of that so far, and that doesn't, uh, not to mention knocking down threes as we go. Crutcher able to win possession back here for the squadron. Now he's left all alone, and he puts in the three. Former Kansas Jayhawk Marcus Garrett. The Greensboro. 19-point lead now for Greensboro. The squadron trying to cut into it. Final 10 minutes of this first half. Motkovich inside, spinning one way, then the other, and flipped it in. Okay, so let's just add to the they're playing great, but they're making some tough shots as well. And that's what you have to do to beat. Hill going at Pokachevsky on this end. That pass deflected by Bazemore. Off the redirect, Crutcher has to get it up and finishes with the offhand. How pretty was that? Well, the Swarm have put up some threes tonight. In fact, they put up more than the Squadron, but they've also made more as Hill tried to get there and did. What a tough bucket that was for Malcolm Hill. Picked up by the Hornets a couple of weeks ago. Nice pocket pass, E.J. Liddell the flush. Squadron a chance to tie it on this trip with a long range make. Seabrin thought about it instead. Hill's open. He's got it. Tie game. First three minutes have gone splendidly for the squadron. Bailey a little short for the mid range. Nolly leading the break. Hill fires again. He's no got way. it. No way. <laughs> Time out, Greensboro. It's been a tough night at the free throw line for Alexei Pokashevsky. Just a couple of points tonight. Crutcher spotted up again. Yes, sir. Seabrin. In the corner, takes, no. and makes. <laughs> no. Join the party, join the party, the three-point party. And here comes Bailey in transition. He is not going to stop. He is not going to stop. He's going to get all the way to the rim, and nine times out of ten, he's going to finish. Amari Bailey continues to put this Greensboro offense on his back tonight. Landers Nolly was running out of real estate in a hurry. Somehow got it away. Good cut. Liddell lays it in, and the foul. They're playing in the league. Spent a lot of time on assignment here in Birmingham, trying to get his feet back under him. Good finish inside. Tillman through the contact, a chance at a three-point play of his own. Squadron looking for their fifth win over their last six games. Seaburn finds wow. another open shooter. Wow. Hill catches it again. Wow. It's <laughs> right back to the squadron's leading scorer. Pocket pass again, this time Motkovich lays it in. This time he does exactly what I told him not to do and it works. <laughs> Good hustle there from Darian Seabrook, oh but Hill lost it. Sims attacks and scores, plus one. And I can tell you the Birmingham squadron to turn their defense up here in the second half. Up top, Motkovich wow. throws it down. <laughs> Jalen Crutcher, I thought it was gonna be his Trademark floater. Well, it helps to have him in the game. <laughs> Here's the alley-oop right here. There's the toss. There's the finish by the big fellow. He didn't get called. He, he did a good job. Oh, nice that find. One. Oh, my. Brown right back in after throwing it inbounds. Pokashevsky found him. 
for people to come and watch uh, NBA-style basketball right here in the hometown. A.J. Liddell showing off the touch. There's though. another reason why right there. Become a solid, solid defender on, for the Birmingham squadron. Liddell, his floater, gets yeah. the roll down. Nice pass right there, a little pocket pass by Malcolm Hill. E.J. knocks one down. Big shot. Liddell becomes the fourth member of the squadron in double figures in scoring tonight, closing in on a double-double. To the corner, Pogoshevsky drives and dunks. Seabird in transition, attacks, lays it in, and one. And finally, and the squadron who are enjoying their largest lead at any point tonight, trying to put this game on ice. Monkovic, one more time. Coming off the bench. Quarter, and believe me, two minutes and 19 seconds is plenty of time for this one to change as well. <laughs> Seabrin <laughs> dribbled it off his foot. But he saw, he saw the big fella cutting the baseline. And he, he was going to get him another assist as well. That's why I like to have Galen Robinson in the game at this particular time. The Birmingham squadron win their fifth game over their last six. They come back from down 19 tonight to take out the Swarm 110-96.